How's it going out there? My name's Adam Paulson, and I, uh, I, I love model railroading, and I'm always looking for little tricks and little things to save money and stuff like that. And I've been working with uh, Atlas's switch machines, their deluxe under table switch machines, and was trying to find some other ways to power them and stuff. And I've looked at tons and tons and tons of internet videos about different ways to power them and people using old transformers, stuff like that. Well, I had a revelation last night and I got to thinking about some stuff and was doing some research and so forth and I never would have dreamed it, but I came up with a pretty good idea. And I don't know, somebody else out there may have done this before, but for anybody that hasn't seen it, here it is. So I'm gonna switch the camera around here so you can see it. This is what I got. This is actually a doorbell transformer. Now, in your doorbell system, in the wiring, it there is actually a transformer in there that drops your voltage down from one from 120 down to about anywhere from 9 to 16 volts, or in some cases 24 volts. Now, how many people have seen this new video ring doorbell? Well, everybody's you know some of the older transformers. They, like they said, they would just go, they would just drop it down to, you know, 9, 12 uh, volts. Still AC, but it's just a lower voltage. So, that's what this is. It's a doorbell transformer for any old household use. Now, you'll notice that it does have three lugs on it. In this case, I've got it pulled off the center lug and the right lug, and when I test across it, it's coming up to about 18 and a half volts. You could go to the farthest left lug, which is here, and the farthest right lug, which is over here, and pull 24 volts AC, which is low voltage. Or you can pull from here to here and pull, I think it's like nine, eight or nine volts, something like that. Using these Atlas switch machines, these under table ones, when I use a power pack for a normal HO scale layout, the accessory is putting out about 18 and a half to 19. It depends on, it, it, it truly does depend on what uh, power pack you're using. Cheap, inexpensive, got it at Lowe's last night for 16 bucks. Just something to think about. All I did was wire it into an old cord That is how you, that's where you would wire it into a house regardless. So I wired it into an old cord. Forgive the mess. This is just temporary. I'm just doing some testing and stuff. Doorbell transformer. Steps down from 120 down to about, I've got on these two lugs here, down to about 18 volts. 18, 19, something like that. I know, horrible wiring. I'm just doing some testing. Ran over to the switch tied the switch in the switch machine operates just the same as if you pull it off a power pack for 16 bucks hope this maybe helped somebody out there i know i wish i would have had a video that would have told me this just an idea hope you have a good one thanks